Hi guys and welcome back to a brand new vlog. So I didn't vlog when I was out getting all this stuff because I was kind of in a rush but I can show you guys everything that I got for the baby. I'm so happy that I found like a lot of things that she actually like really needed for her bedroom and then I have another surprise. Well, I'll show you guys that first. I changed her room around like literally all the way. I love it like this. She has a lot of space you know to like play and stuff because that's what like we were kind of like struggling with before. She didn't have like a lot of play, like space to like play but I'll show you guys. You'll know. Oh, yeah guys. Okay so these are like you know her whole toy area. So now she has like all of this space to play. So I moved like the crib just like on the you know window wall. Don't mind the laundry over there but this changing tables over here now and that is just right here and I feel like it looks a lot nicer like this so she can have you know she's crazy she'll have more space now to like play guys i got her so since she's been a newborn she's had the same like toy box so i wanted to get her a different one so i got her this paris one and i know it doesn't look big it looks kind of big so i was gonna see you know if all her toys will fit in here i got her the abc little floor puzzle map thingy because she really needed this like I really wanted her to have one really bad, so I'm glad that I found one. And then I actually went to a thrift shop and found this one. So this is just like a little mirror for her, so I'm gonna like clean it and then put it in her room. I found her a book of literally just like, you know, a bunch of different things so she can just, you know, start learning like the basics of everything. I, so like since Christmas is coming up in like, what, two months, one, whatever, but I got her a little like Christmas blanket. She really needed like more blankets and stuff, so I thought that was cute. Even not being christmas she can still use this so with all of the letters it looks so much better and then like the box and stuff i like it i love her room now it's like you know i feel like she's gonna like this and then i can try to teach her you know her alphabet more guys right now we're at walmart trying to find mariana a halloween costume it's trick-or-treating this weekend okay so i'm getting her costume like pretty much last minute so i'm gonna see like what we're working with here because there's not a lot see there's not that much to work with this is so cute. But I feel like she wouldn't keep. I kind of wanted her to be um, Mickey. You mean Minnie? Minnie? Mickey? Minnie. Oh, Minnie. Whatever. 12 to 18. That's her size, 12 to 18. Yeah. And. It's a couple. Oh, she'd have to wear like black leggings. Yeah. That's how I wear the black long sleeve. Oh. <laughs> yeah, so she's not so cold. It's gonna be cold outside. Aww, so many. But every time I find one I like, they don't have her size. I mean, like this that is one. Her size. And I like this one. And they do have her size. Aww. Guys, and I'm also just buying Mariana like more hats and gloves. She needed another pair because you know she always lose. We always lose them. And I got her some food, formula, oh, all of that. Huh? That's the one I wanted to get her because then she'll be so warm. Mm -hmm. Do you think so? Yeah. That's cute. As you can tell, we got home about a couple minutes ago, but I'm going to show you guys the costume that I ended up picking out. I called Gabe and we agreed on this costume, so I'm going to show you guys. And it's just nicer because when she goes trick-or-treating and stuff, you guys know here, it's really cold. So this is like best for like, you know, the climate and all that, but I'll show you. So I got her this one, a little pink monster, because she's literally always making monster noises. But it's so cute. Everything's in here already. So she's going to be very warm. You don't have to worry about like, obviously we're going to put clothes under this, but you guys know. And then I think her noise machine came in. So I'm going to open that and show you guys this noise machine that I got her. I've been wanting this lunch. She was a newborn. <gasps> yes. So this is the one that like literally the whole like ceiling, like the whole ceiling will like light up. So I'm gonna like try to set it up really quick. You see, that's cool. Because the baby has actually been having like hard times like sleeping at night now that she is, um, well she's been teething, you know, but we're trying to lean her off of formula and just do more almond milk and coconut milk. So she's gonna have more of a, like a challenge falling asleep lately and I'm gonna try to get her into her crib soon. So this will come in handy. That honestly looks so cool. It's just, it's not really showing on the ceiling a lot. How like, you know, it's light outside. Guys, my baby just came home. Mama missed you from Dada so much. Guys, let me tell you, being away from Mariana was like so hard for the night. Like, I miss my baby so much. Because you have to think, guys, I 
the whole year she's been alive, I've only left once to go to a hotel for the night. And I came back, like, literally the next morning to see her. So, this was, like, my real, real night away from her. And it would, let me tell you guys, it was hard. I barely slept at all. Like, I need my baby. Like, Mama needs you to sleep. Mm -hmm. It's stuck for Mama too. You want Here, look at <gasps> Star? 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 She's so smart. Oh, let's, where is it? Stick it in the star. Right here. No, no, no. Okay. <laughs> Mariana, look at This is what you're going to be for Halloween. Look at a monster. Do you see that? A monster. Oh, guys, you're so cute. I love you. A monster. Do, rawr. Do the noise. Rawr. Girl, you always do that noise. She loves the letters, guys. I'm happy she likes it. You like them? Yeah? You're the cutest, Mama. Baby shark. Hi, guys. So we just woke up about 10 minutes ago. I literally woke up to a baby throwing up all over me. And then I look down and there's poop everywhere. I think that she caught something because the last two days this has kind of been happening, but she hasn't been throwing up. And this is her first time like throwing up, so I don't know. You okay? I don't like when you're sick. I'm making mama sad. Yeah, I don't like you throwing up. But it got all over our sheets, all over our pillows, everywhere. So I took them downstairs already, cleaned those, threw her clothes in the dryer, washer, whatever. Um, but yeah, and then I looked at my shirt and there's poop all over it. It was, it was so fun. It was amazing. Guys, so it's a couple hours later. Now that her stomach is settled, I'm going to feed her. I'm going to feed her some eggs. So here, so I made us some toast and eggs. Yummy. Mmm. Guys, so I have not put a shirt on her. Just been keeping this on her because she has thrown up over five times today. I am not going through no more outfits today. No, you threw up so many times. And I have so much laundry to do now, guys. It's ridiculous. But it's okay. But I'm, like, honestly confused, like, what she's sick with. I don't know. Like, obviously, she could have caught something, like, at the party and stuff. But she's been having, like, diarrhea, guys. A lot of it. And then she's been throwing up just recent, like, today, this morning. I literally woke up to her throwing up on me, which it's fine. But I was like, girl, who wants to wake up to that? You know. But I just want her to feel better. But I gave her some electrolytes. And then I just fed her her food. So hopefully with that, she'll start feeling better. I just want her to kind of like, you know, play, take it easy today and all that. Guys, do you see my crazy baby right now? She is so cute. But she makes me nervous. She always wants to play where she is not really allowed to play. Like, you know, guys right here. She's not really allowed to play, but she doesn't listen. So what can you do? Just watch her closely. But she's starting to like walk more, as you can tell. <gasps> Hi, Broadway! You guys see we have a new dog just staying here just tonight. My aunt is at a wedding, so we're just watching him. He's such a sweet dog. He loves Mariana so much. What you doing? Get it, get it. But yeah, guys, I apologize. This vlog has not been like very consistent. Hi, guys. So it's a couple hours later, and right now we're just kind of chilling today is sunday um we just had a really chill like kind of weekend because of mariana being throwing you know sick she's kind of sick i honestly don't know like why she's throwing up but she kind of stopped throwing up now but just like the last day you know she just stopped yesterday so we're like let's let's have her take it easy and stuff but right now guys she's being crazy you're playing with uncle i'm glad though that she is feeling so much better i can tell she's cray cray like it? Pokemon. Okay. Okay. <laughs> what? She's so sweet. Say uncle. Uncle. Guys, she's so. <gasps> uncle. 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 You drink so she much always, water. She drink so much water, and she always like like, it, choked though. from it. You gotta be. Ooh. You drink the water type. <laughs> but yeah, guys, I don't want this vlog to be like any more choppy. We're really not doing anything for the rest of the night. So tomorrow is a new day. So I'm gonna start a new vlog tomorrow. She spit it all out. She did. <laughs> 
So I'm going to end this vlog out right now. So the post notification shout out goes to my pretty little everything. Thank you so much for being part of the family and supporting us through this journey. But until next time, guys. What? Bye. What?